Hello and welcome to Pokey Dippies. I'm your host, Joe Zamora. You can find my stuff on uh, Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, all under Zamora Gaming. And I am here to introduce Pokey Dippies, brought to you by Zamora Gaming. And first, I'd like to introduce David. Hey, this is GS Kamikaze, a.k.a. David Allen East, a.k.a. Mr. Steal Your Girl, a.k.a. I'm just kidding. <laughs> You can find me on Facebook, and that's pretty much it right now, as GS Kamikaze, streaming Pokemon VGC and Draft League content, and seven minutes. You're witnessing a streamer be born. Next up, we got Morgan. All right. Hey, what's up, guys? Um, I'm Morgan. Uh, I go by stream content on uh, several different things. I'm always a little drunk on here, so... So uh, it's a, it seems to be an issue now. Uh, um, you can find me. You can find me on anything under the handle Morgan Oko. That's M O R G A N O H K O. Make sure you check out my Twitter for uh, my draft league battles, and uh, I do tie-in videos to all these episodes. So come check me out. And last but certainly not least, we have Stuart. G'day, I'm Stu. Uh, not as exciting as these guys. Just you can look me up on Facebook, Stuart J Mills, or Twitter, SJ Mills 101. Um, I'm always around the parts on PML. Come and join the group. Get in on the action. Um, draft, raids, battles, tournaments. You name it, we got it. Alrighty. And yeah, here we go. Well, now that everyone is formally introduced, here we go. Talking about the Pokemon of the week. We have Arcanine with abilities known as Intimidate and Flash Fire with a hidden ability of Justified. His typing is only fire. His stats are 90 HP, 110 attack, 80 defense, 100 special attack, 80 special defense, and 95 speed. What do y'all guys think about this Pokemon right here? I really Talk like its design. Though. All right, yeah, I design. got them. All right, so listen. I'm going to describe the full bio biology of this Pokemon, okay? Like oh, everything shit. that, just like the, the most general basic shit, okay? It evolves from Growlithe. My kid's got a plush of a Growlithe that he calls Growly. And it's oh, an that's adorable. <laughs> Uh, that's a shit nickname. That's a shit nickname. <laughs> no one cares about the kid name. <laughs> he said that's a shit nickname, and you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna agree now. You know what? Fuck that. Ruthless. All episode. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck that. You got seven minutes to explain that nickname. <laughs> <laughs> but it, it looks like a tiger. It's got traits of a tiger and a lion, and it has a distinct long no dog-like muzzle with a large round black nose. Its eyes are triangular in shape with black pupils. It has short diamond-shaped orange ears with cream-colored insides. The majority of Arcanine's body is covered with bright orange fur with jagged black stripes resembling the fur of a tiger. It's most of its head and face and its chest legs are covered in light green-colored fluffy tufts of fur. It has a long green-colored tail. This motherfucker will destroy so much. You can use it in so many different ways competitively and it's one of the coolest pokemon's ever been made it's uh, it used it was originally going to be a legendary pokemon wow wait a oh, really all, really wait, wait, all the facts yes. away from us. really really time out time out where'd you read that at where'd you see that at uh, he used to be a lit no was, he was going to be a legend in pokemon it, it was originally it's supposed to, it was originally supposed yeah. to be like uh Lugia of the three legendary birds, but they ended up changing it in the anime. Because if you remember uh, when Ash saw Ho oh right after the sparrow thing in the first Pokemon Center, it shows uh, Articuno, Moltres, Zapdos, and Arcanine. And he was supposed to be basically like the keeper of the three legendary birds. And it's like, okay, Magic out the that's fish. sick. Magic I did not know that. And that's why yeah, Magic out the first in the Pokemon. Pokedex as the legendary Mon. That's right. What did you say, Stuart? Just like Magikarp is the fish Pokemon, 
Arcanine's legendary Pokemon. Like that's its tagline in the Pokedex. Oh yeah, you're right. That was on the yeah. the the yeah. card too, the original TCG card. You're right. Yeah, that's right. Wow, look at that! A fucking I'm learning shit every episode. You see, if, if listen to us for anything other like the education, we are we are very smart people. And All of us, in between, well, incredibly in intelligent, all of incredibly also, intellectual. And also, if if you want to look at it in that terms, he would be the only legendary to have under base six hundred stats. Damn. Yeah, damn. So he did my boy so wrong he's like that. Not that legendary, is he? Well, all right. Correct me if I'm wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong, but uh, he was the first Pokemon to get extreme speed. Is that right? Was. That was his signature move. Yep. It was him. There you go. I yeah, this is move. I just wanted to talk about how this Pokemon. So you guys don't play very much doubles, but Gra- uh, Arcanine a has a hidden ability called Justified, where if you hit it with like a beat up, you can give it a plus four attack, and it'll literally Oko everything on the fucking field. Yeah, you normally beat up a pussy. So. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, oh, I don't know about you. Yum. A mouthful of cold cold. No good. Yum. <laughs> Yum. Yum. <laughs> Yummy. No, but no. Oh, yeah. the first time I saw that was at the Dallas Regionals, and it really annoyed me because I was like, "Fucking gimmicks, man! Fucking gimmicks!" Everybody's got one. <laughs> you have to have one, or you can't make it. I know. I guess that's my problem. I play too straight. You gotta have one. You gotta have a gimmick. You gotta find a, w- a way to slip in there and park your car. You know what I'm saying? That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> you're, d- you're damn right. Park that is exactly what she said. Right in this little garage. How much money that, would you pay? That means... Little that means garage. Pussy. How much money would you pay to hug an Arcanine? They just look so soft. I wouldn't... I you know... Pay. I think it would be a good mount. <laughs> I think it would be a good mount. You could ride it around town. It's big as fuck. How tall is it? Didn't you say you didn't you say how tall it was, David? It is six feet tall. Holy shit! Good lord, dude. Yeah, six, six foot three. That was my man. That, that was my f- weighs almost three hundred and fifty pounds, dude. You could fucking that thing would be the perfect firefighter companion. It's a like, car. <laughs> you get a flash that- fire Arcanine, and that's a that's a firefighter, bro. He's coming in that building. He's just eating fire and shit. Doesn't that was my, my that was my main ground mount in uh Let's Go. It was an Arcanine. Yes. Bro, I didn't even make it far enough in Let's Go to ride it. Fucking Arcanine. That's a good game. Saddle up. Saddle up. What do you mean, little doggy? Why are you so pissed, Joe? Fucking Arcanine, what do you mean? Saddle yes, up. Charizard's the only fire type you need in Gen 1. That's why. Charizard sucks. Well, I was Yo, doing a I was on. doing a playthrough <laughs> with something new. I had used Charizard in everything all the time. I always use Charizard. I try not to use Charizard now because I used him so much. I just need to retire him. He's he's tired. He's tired. He's tired. He's like, God, you guys keep giving me new forms. Stop. No, he's he like, loves it. Super Mega. <laughs> they should have gave fucking Arcanine a Mega. That's who should have got a Mega. Dude, that would have been Arcanine, nice. Arcanine, and Flygon needed Megas, and they didn't they get did. it. All right, what's your idea for Arcanine Mega? How how would you make it better? What stats would you give it? An extra hundred stats, and what typing would you add to it? Dude, you could make it like a Manticore type thing. Do you all know what a Manticore is? It's supposed to be a lion, but he looks kind of like a lion. So you could do like give him wings and turn him into like a mythical Manticore beast. So, make him so a basically, fire what type. you're saying. Fire, Ooh, fire that'd be sick. Like, make him a fire Yeah, make him, make him a better choice. <laughs> Just give, give him a dragon snoot and a tail. Nah, fire, fire dragon. Fire dragon. Do it. No, that'd be sick. Be fire that'd dragon. be sick. No. How sick would that be? Anfros got electric dragon. My boy Arcanine can be a fucking... He can awaken the dragon. Don't but fucking tell him he can't. Tones are, bro. That's weak. I feel like it should no, get something cooler. No. I, I don't care. Manticore. Oh, you Manticore. Know what? I would be cool with a Fire Fairy Arcanine. Oh, that would be actually. Yeah, that would be cool. Yeah. If you made his fur all majestic, like an Altaria type deal, like, like super fluffy. Like just make it fluffier. A, just like make it a bright red with white. No, what I was going to cool. say is Fire Electric. Like a Rotom Heat. The original Rotom Heat, bro. 
Like with the fucking the lines that it already has that can turn into like electricity, its tail could be all staticky and shit. Like that would be. That's a great cool. idea. Original. That's Rotom a sick was idea. Ghost electric. Ghost electric. Yeah, it, original yeah. engine four Rotom Heat was still ghost electric. It wasn't fire. Sorry to burst your bubble. Really? I don't, want, I, I don't care about Gen four. <laughs> Gen four is for shit. <laughs> Wait till November. Then we'll care about Gen four. Yeah. We are going to care a yeah. lot. Oh, everyone's uh, crying for those remakes, so obviously people love Gen 4. Uh, I'm not a huge fan of Gen 4. Wait, wait, which one is Gen 4? Sinnoh? Yeah. Uh, Diamond and Pearl. If they could fix yeah. the spacing. Dude, Diamond and Pearl is one of my least favorite ones. I'm not even going to Dude, it's such a good game. They have one of the best villains. Cyrus, Cyrus was a fucking... He's a, he was a, an evil man. Best yeah. villain. Wait, is that the one that story, has Cynthia Horrible and... gameplay. It has so Giratina, Palkia, and Dialga. Yeah, I know the legendaries, but like, isn't Cynthia <laughs> and uh, the bad guy or the good guy named N in that one? No, N. Is yes. In, no, no, N's. N uh, is N's. Five. Yeah, black and white. He's not the oh, good guy until so black and white too either. Uh, what? Man. <laughs> the only thing I liked about Diamond and Pearl was that you could uh, do the mining and stuff and have a secret base. I like yeah. having the secret base. Feature oh, from underground. Yeah. You like it because there was secret base and miners. That's I don't know. It's us. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, back to Aknon. Back to Aknon. <laughs> he he's a fluffy mount. That's what I have to say. I I will say that I'm a little. I don't think that he has. I don't know. Like I was telling you guys before we started, I don't really see him. In, like the only way I could really see to play him was uh, offensively, so I'm excited to see you guys do something else with him. I didn't know he had such high special attack either, so uh, I don't oh, know, hoping to see team. something. I thought it was pretty much just a special attacker. That was pretty much straightforward special attacker, so we'll see what you guys have done with it. Well, you thought it was a physical attacker, straightforward. Well, yeah, right, I have a... a yeah. Facts. I got a couple facts, guys, alright? So, Arcanine has the highest base stat of any Pokemon that only evolves one time. Did you know that? That's interesting. No. And it's still the And its prototype game. name was Blaze. Could you imagine if Growlithe turned into yeah. fucking Blaze? That's kind of sweet. Mm. I, I like that. that. I like That's that. That's Charizard's ability. Charizard's ability. Charizard's ability, yes. That's Charizard's ability. See, it all comes together. It's a better, it's a better Charizard, really. No, it's, it's not. It's just better Charizard. It's really <laughs> not, honestly. It's supposed to be so... It's possibly a mixed breed of a wolf and a tiger. So, and it's... Ooh, it's said that's in the cool. Anime, or in the yellow Pokedex entries, it says that it was seen in China. That's where it originates. I, in the Pokemon. I, I think it's based off those... Um, you know you know those uh, statues that Asian people have in front of their restaurants and stuff? I, if yes. I remember the correctly, dog. it was based off of that. Hmm... It's pretty sweet. I like that. I learned that from Noggin. Yep. So. Noggin. The Ryuk the Ryukyu and Ryuk I don't know. I can't pronounce Japanese words, unfortunately, but try my best. Oh, Arcanine is is always what they they used to have like Growly or Growlifts. I keep saying Growly because I'm used to that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Growlifts and Arcanine well, have always been like uh, Police Jenny's dog. Like they always have. She always has one of those. Yeah. And in Gen 2, it was replaced by a spinner egg. Give me something else. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, that's it was but also. It was, but it was. It was also one of the Pokemon featured in Detective Pikachu and looked, honestly, like one of the best Pokemon, in my opinion. I uh, agree with it. Charizard was probably the coolest one in that movie, though. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, Charizard. for sure. I, I don't they know. I think they did. I thought they did. did. I thought they did a really good job on all of them, just because they didn't really change the designs at all. Like they did not fuck with it at all. Like it really looked like it, it was straight out of the game, realistic. I, I really enjoyed that movie. Honestly, but they Arcanine, need to make another game, another movie just like that. They will. That would the, be so it, cool. it did so well. It's like one of the only video game adaptations mm -hmm. that have done well in like the last ten years. So. They'll do, they'll, I guarantee they'll do something else with it. Dude. Anything Ryan Reynolds touches now is fucking gold somehow. Dude, because Ryan Reynolds is the fucking funniest dude on earth, bro. Like, yeah, I can't... And, 
and I'm not gay, but he's a beautiful man. Oh, so he beautiful man. <laughs> he's the most yeah. he's the most beautiful man in America. I think every man can agree that he is the most wow. beautiful man. Yeah, he's beautiful. You know, I can't help it. Own a a uh, an Arcanine in the anime? <laughs> no, I didn't know that. What happened? Gary was the first one to own or like have an Arcanine. Well, yeah, because he was fucking Gary. I remember Dude. it being on his team. I remember it being a pain that, in the ass. Yo. He was a can't f- say that. What? He was fucking Gary. <laughs> oh, you yeah. Think I said? <laughs> Gary. <laughs> he, he, was I Gary. <laughs> he was fucking Gary hard. <laughs> <laughs> That's what. <laughs> yeah. Arcanine, I don't uh, want it tonight. Uh, fucking Gary. I don't give a shit. <laughs> you gonna <God>. get it. <laughs> Ralph. Ralph. <laughs> You know, because he's a dog. Yeah. Rough. Rough. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I did want to say one thing yeah. about the Pokemon uh, <laughs> Detective Pikachu movie thing. Uh, they should make a live action uh, Pokemon first movie. Uh, That'd be I sick. Don't know, I don't, uh, I don't feel like they can do it do justice. It. Blade. They shouldn't do it because people will bitch about it. They their only reason Detective Pikachu did so well is because they did not try to change anything. They didn't go in and try and do something that's already been done. Like they really honestly didn't try and pull at your nostalgia very much, other than like it's it was Pokemon, but like it wasn't like just the bait the the first the Kanto Pokemon. Like it was it was very spread out through generations. So I don't know. I don't know. I, I just think it would be cool. Cooler than the adaptation they did on Netflix. I feel like Dude, people... I think it would be cool. Series. I think it would be cool. Like the Pikachu series, but with like the actual anime storyline and make it the detec- Detective Pikachu like uh, production, basically. Yeah, that'd, that'd be, be really sick, cool. and an but people would bitch. Battler who ages. Since it's That's easy money. Easy money. Like, yeah, if they can but make people... that, like, PG-14, dude, people would fucking love that show. Who's PG-14? Uh, well, What's that? They should just write it. Like, they should you, just write can, it. Sure. Like, it's a little more <laughs> adulterated, but it's not, like, so much where it's, like, people are fucking dying. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. They should just gotcha, make gotcha. it rated for mature and just start killing people with blood, splatters, and everything. Oh, good lord. Kind of like the manga, but without death, basically. The manga's <laughs> good. The manga's dark. No, I know. That's why. But if they could do that with like a live action show, but you know, since it's still Pokemon, so it's for kids, not show death. You know, it, it'd still be good. If I'd you got it, it from Japan, if Japan made it, that's what you would get. You'd get something good like that from Japan, <laughs> but it'd be in Japanese. So I'd rather watch that than the American version, honestly. Huh? Hmm. Tomato, tomato. Tomato, tomato. But back to Arkham. Well, Arcanine, again. Yeah, Arcanine, dude. <laughs> <laughs> <guys> seen Arcanine? <laughs> Anybody got any favorite uh, anime battles featuring Arcanine? Origins. I'm pretty sure it's in Origins. I remember. Is I remember it? he he raced against. Was it? I can't remember what a Pokemon Ash had, but there was a race with Arcanine in it. Might have been Meganium or Bayleaf. I honestly don't I'm remember I'm much about Arcanine in the anime either. Really? Yeah, I mm. mean, I remember seeing it. Well, it is one of the very first dog. Pokemon you see. That's like... What? It's very yeah. like when you see you. Don't you see Ash riding it in the beginning Do what? sequence? No, he's running next to it in the beginning sequence. Doesn't Ash ride it? No, he never rides Arcanine. Oh, but it's just running next to him. I got you. Yeah. Got you, I got you. Well, but it is pretty fucking cool. I wish it would have been the legendary. It would have been really nice. They yeah. should have, dude. They could have made it so much better. And they gave it like when they gave it beat up. That's okay and everything because they made VGC doubles only. But they could have gave it. They could have gave it more justice. You got Entei. You got Entei. Eh, and even then, Entei is not that great. No. But I feel like Arcanine's better than Entei, honestly, other than like Sacred Fire, really. No, oh, no, he's most you can definitely use Arcanine better. For Will-O-Wisp. You can use Will O Wisp, Toxic, you can Scorching Sands him now. Like, you can hit everything. Wild Charge, 
they made it have really good coverage moves, but he just gave away a sit. Like... He just gave away a sit for the battles, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure you bring uh, your, bring your heel ball for the Willow. No, you yeah. want to know what's embarrassing? Maybe. The volcano Pokemon can't learn earthquake, but Dunsparce can. Stupid Dunsparce. Dunsparce is god, bro. What do you mean? I'm just saying that that that's the main comparison. Entei is not better than Arcanine. Entei is not better than Arcanine. I agree. <laughs> Arcanine is probably on the top out of the top five Gen One Pokemon. It's probably like top four, or top three. I would say you no. got Dragonite, Gengar, Charizard, and then Arcanine. <laughs> hey, why'd you say it like that? Yeah, I know. Talking shit, <laughs> asshole. <laughs> asshole. <laughs> Cut him off, cut him off. All right, guys. Uh, David's no longer on the show. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fired. All right, guys. Well, I guess let's uh, move on. Does anyone else have to say anything about Arcanine? I think uh, everyone's exhausted what they can say about this mod. I have nothing else to say about him. Take him away. All right. I gonna... feel like they didn't they didn't give us enough info on it. Like it's not it's it's not that big of a player in the anime or anything. Like it's been in a lot of episodes, but it doesn't really do anything like memorable that I remember. Yeah, I could agree with that. It is decent in VGC though. It does have uh, the intimidate <laughs> and uh, you know just pure attacking power, but. Other than that, it's a weaker art. It's a weaker Incineroar. <clears throat> yes, it's it's a bad Incineroar. Is what it is. I don't know. It, it's I feel like it can be better than Incineroar depending on your team comp composition. It just I just like defenses. Incineroar so much more. Yeah, it just doesn't have the defenses like uh, Incineroar, but it does have better speed. It do have a little bit extra speed. It do, but it doesn't have fake out, so it sucks. <laughs> or potting, or potting shot. Yeah, or parting shot. Like, man, they just did, they didn't do it good enough. All right. Well, I guess that's it for this portion of the episode. Uh, let's move on to talking about our teams. All right. Now that we've talked about Arcanine stats and such, David's going to go ahead and start us off with talking about his team. <clears throat> All right. First off, got the mascot of the episode, Arcanine, nicknamed Venus, a.k.a. Very Big Penis. It's got Intimidate to make my team a little bit bulkier um, keeps the physical attacks kind of down and it's a good pivot I have toxic morning sun scorching sands and flamethrower just in case everyone else is going to be using their own intimidate arcanine mm -hmm. to kind of check arcanine most likely so morning sun and toxic together is pretty deadly on arcanine just because no one really expects that and it's got a lot of longevity then I have Seven fucking minutes, the Rillaboom. Um, that's Choice Banded with Grassy Glide, Knockoff, High Horsepower, and U Turn, and Max Attack, Max HP. It's basically my favorite Pokemon. We use it on almost every team I have, every draft league I'm in, and it just, it's a really good wall breaker with priority and stab and terrain. Then I have my Drift Blim, nicknamed 6 0 Joe. <laughs> with the grassy seed and unburdened ability so it gets super fast after it comes in after Rillaboom and it's got Calm Mind, Shadow Ball, Air, air Cutter and Strength Sap to basically I can build up my bulk really fast especially with Calm Mind after I get the unburdened boost and then I can Strength Sap and heal myself while also taking their attack damage down uh, your, so. your audio went a little funky uh can you hear me now? I can hear you, but it sounds like you're a robot. Oh, that's weird. I don't know what happened. There you go. Get back. <laughs> All right. And then I got Hatterene Choke Me with the <laughs> Focus Sash. <laughs> it's got Magic Bounce Ability, Trick Room Psychic, Dazzling Gleam, and Mystical Fire with Max HP and Special Attack. So I can set off a Trick Room, <laughs> Bounce Back Half, <laughs> or just fucking destroy things. You know, or and then my next Pokemon is Zapdos, like you hate me, with a life orb. <laughs> it's got the static ability, so if some U turns into it or hits it physically, it's gonna possibly get paralyzed and slow it down quite a bit. Then it's got Hurricane Thunder, Heat Wave, and Roost. 
It was built to be used with Pelipper, my last Pokemon, because of the rain ability, Drizzle, and the Damp Rock. And got Roost, Defog, Scald, and U-Turn, just to keep more longevity on the team, lower the fire damage towards Rillaboom, and give me Hurricane and Thunder accuracy for my Zapdos. That is my team. We'll see how it does. Now let's go ahead and move on to Stuart. Yo, so I started off with uh, Arcanine as well, the Pokemon of the week. Um, his name was Mike Cox on Fire. Um, <laughs> you know, he's a fire type, and you know, if you're not careful, your cock will be on fire. Anyway, uh, I went with the Flebit's Extreme Speed Wild Charge Morning Sun. Um, I was very bulky, I was very low speed, and I was almost uh, max attack. I had the Electrium Z to power up that wild charge so I face any water types that were coming to beat my Arcanine. Um, apart from Mega Swampert, obviously, which is probably going to be an issue. Um, my next one was Crocodile. I uh, named him Mike Hunt. He was Choice Scarf <laughs> Moxie. Um, Crocodile is one of my favorite mons, so um, definitely wanted to bring him as my ground type. Earthquake knockoff, close combat, and um, Scarf Stealth Rocks, which I know uh, Joe loves. That's one of his favorites. Um, my my water type was Swampert. Um, his name was Phil McCracken. He was carrying a Swampert type, and he was running Earthquake, Waterfall, Superpower, and the brand new Flip Turn, which is you know one of the best new moves in the game, I think, anyway. Uh, my water type, my, sorry, my rain setter that I ran with Swampert was Bend Over the Pelipper. He was carrying the Damp Rock for that uh, eight turns of rain. Um, he was max HP, almost max speed F, a little bit of defense, called U turn roost, uh, roost deep bomb. Um, I got Connie Lingus, the Tapu Koko, uh, <laughs> running Choice Specs, Vault Switch, Thunderbolt, Grass Knot, Dazzling Gleam, max speed, max special attack, pretty straightforward. Top of Coco there, and then um, running the since I was running the electric surge, I was like, I'm gonna bring a law and right to for surge surfer, nasty plot, grass knot, side shot, rising voltage, and her name was Ophelia S. There you go, <laughs> beautiful. That's my team, and I, I hope it goes well. Like, um, I'm sure you guys have got plenty of encounters, but we'll see. Morgan's not able to talk about his team right now because he had to go somewhere really quick, but he'll be back for the battles. But I'm going to go ahead and end it here with my team. I have Arcanine, of course, nicknamed RK9, two letters and a number. And it is a Assault Vest Arcanine with Flash Fire because everyone else has one, so I figured that'd be useful. Then I have a Flare Blitz, Close Combat, Play Rough, Wild Charge with Max Attack, Max Speed. And it's shiny. Then we move on to Dippy the Gastrodon, of course the blue one. And uh, it has leftover Storm Drain, just in case people wanted to kill my Arcanine with water. It wasn't going to happen. And it is uh, Max HP, Special Attack 156, and Special Defense 100, so it is very specially bulky with Recover, Scald, Yawn, and Earth Power. Then next we have Purple Testes, uh, Among Us. <laughs> it is a Shiny, of course, with uh, Rocky Helmet Regenerator, uh, Clear Smog, Spore, Giga Drain, Sludge Bomb, Max HP, Max Defense, with 4 Special Attack, and it was pretty much there just to wall any physical presence that was there. But we'll see how that goes. Alright, next we have Mr. Sneak, the Dragapult, shinied up with the Life Orb Infiltrator set. We have Dragon Dance with Dragon Dart, Sucker Punch, Phantom Force to get most out of his stabs with max attack and max special, I mean max speed with four special defense, just in case. Then we also have next uh, Scissor Hands, the Scizor, with the Mega Scissorite. Technician, Bug Bite, Bullet Punch, Dual Wing Beat for those Focus Sashers, and Assurance to have a... Uh, I forget why I put Assurance on there. Double damage if you get hit first, is that right? Yeah. yeah. Oh, and it was also Technician boosted, so I was like, fuck it, why not? 
but we are uh, 252 attack, 56 speed, and 200 HP just to be a little bit more on the bulky side. Obviously won't live a fire hit, but we'll pretty much live anything else. And then lastly but not leastly, we have Blackface the Shiny Tapu Lele with Scarf and Psychic Surge. And it is a Moon Blast, Energy Ball, Shadow Ball, Psychic, of course, all attacks because it's Choice Scarf with max special attack and max speed. All right. That is it for this. Let's go ahead and move on to the battles. All right, now that we've talked about our teams, let's put them to the test. First up, we got Morgan versus Stuart. All right, let's fucking go, Stu. We'll play Morgan. Just bring it. And the person <laughs> who's announcing today is David. Oh, wow. Hey, Look at boy. our teams. Look at our teams. Wow. Very similar teams here. I'm, I'm scared by your team. Oh, I'm scared by your team. I'm scared of Coco. I'm trying to join it. All right, we're in there. We're in there. All right, don't start yet. Don't start yet. All right? So... In the blue corner, we got Stew Dog 101. He's got our canine, Crocodile, Swampert, Pelipper, Tapu Coco, and Raichu. This is a fucking spicy team. I already can see this going crazy. I see so and then so we got so our canine. Oh, in the red corner, in the red corner, we have Morgan, aka Morgan Oko. He's got our canine, Zapdos, Garchomp, Swampert, Toxapex, and he's got Grimmsnarl. And now we are going to start. All right, let's if fucking is, go, Stu. If this is screens Grimmsnarl, I'm going to be well pissed, just so you know. <laughs> I'm going to be, I'm going to be Joe Six O pissed. <laughs> I, I I don't know, dude. Your team looks rough. Your team looks rough for me. Oh, and we got gonna be bend over the Pelipper coming out from Stu Dog side on the blue corner, and then we got seven fucking minutes out of the Grimmsnarl uh, from Morgan. Starting off, we've got, we've got rain popping off. Get a light screen off with a U-turn coming out of bend over the Pelipper. Bend over. <laughs> ben Dover. I see Swift Two words. In your future. Benjamin Dover. Tapu Coco comes out. And his nickname is Connie Lingus. And we all know what that <laughs> means. Don't get me started. It's a beautiful thing. It's a natural part of life. <laughs> Yeah, what is more going to do with response? Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. I don't know. Hold on, hold on. I got to think for a second. Give me a second. And he's thinking for seven minutes. Roid Rage, the Swamper, comes out for a dazzling gleam through the light screen. And we, uh, we're we going to see how this plays out. I'm going to... Oh, shit, shit, shit. Hold on. Okay, yes. No, it didn't let me cancel. Fuck. Okay, so Roid Rage, the Swampert, went up for an ice punch <laughs> into Bend Over the Pelipper. It did, it did a nice Morgan chunk of damage. Rage. It's okay, it's, it's okay. Rage. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. He didn't make it because he's stupid. <laughs> I fucking, that's why I tried. I, I fucking meant to cancel. I, I'm not playing on a fucking, suck my balls. Suck my balls. Suck my balls, just get it. Bro, I almost used Mega Swampert too. I'm glad I didn't. God damn Suck my balls. Mr. Garrison. <laughs> Shut my Burn mouth. The yes! Oh, he burned oh. me. Yeah. He risked it. Bastard. Risky Bastard. Why did you rock slide, you fuck? Just saying. I don't have rock slide on him. I don't have rock slide on him. Oh, and Morgan Oko missed the first mistake of his game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Hmm. The, first mistake, <laughs> the first mistake was not dynamite. I mean, mega evolving. It was an accident. Shut the fuck <laughs> up, <laughs> bitch. So Mega Swampert goes for Stealth Rocks while Pelipper the Bend Over goes for a Roost mm. and he's got full HP. Wow. Swampert is burnt and crippled. Well, <clears throat> I think uh, after you say the nickname and the Pokemon, you can just go with the nickname after that. All right. So Zapdos, let me peck it, comes out. <laughs> <laughs> He switches into a default from Bend Over. So now, what do you, what do we think that this Pelipper is actually going to do? U turn. Straight switching into Tapu Coco. He's going to eat a discharge. It's not going to do a ton. All right, all right. 
Connie Lingus is about to eat that pussy. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> about to eat that pussy. Yummy. Yummy. All in. It's the only way I know how to go. Goes for the bowl switch and oh. damage to the lucky packet. Didn't expect that. And, and he's gonna switch in two. Hmm. I don't know, actually. What does that those two? He's probably gonna run calcs to figure out what would be the best <laughs> decision. No, nah, I'm not running any calcs. I'm not running calcs. <laughs> oh, and let me pack it goes for a tailwind. Okay, so right. now Ophelia Rass. <laughs> the right now on the fucking psychic surge. You get the double speed boost. <laughs> oh. oh beautiful. Oh, and goes for a rising voltage into Roid Raid, the burnt swampert. <laughs> I don't know. Ophelia Rass. <laughs> <laughs> ah Nice. I like that. <laughs> All right, what's what's going to happen here? What's going to happen here? Um, hmm. Roid Rage, contemplating what to do in the red corner. Oh, oh tough, oh. tough, tough. That's bad. That's bad. Ophelia ass switches into bend over, and now, F you Jesse the Arcanine comes out. For it wouldn't let me. Say, it wouldn't let me say fuck you, Jesse. And you're not even <laughs> here tonight, Jesse. So fuck you, extra. <laughs> Commentating, bitch. Yeah, old bitch ass commentating ass. I like Jesse. I like him. I miss him. <laughs> now, if you remember, Morgan Oko said that he was going to use Wild Charge in offensive Arcanine. Let's see if he actually has that move, or is he bluffing? I didn't say that, but I I'm not saying anything right now. Shush, shush. Stop <laughs> talking. He's predicting the crook and going play rough. He, he's he could be. I do not have I do not have play rough on him. I don't have play rough. Oh my god, what are you doing then? Shut up. Let me do what I'm doing. <laughs> Seven minutes comes back out and Swampert the film McCracken <laughs> switches in for Pelipper. Bend over. <laughs> Bend over to film my Kraken. <laughs> Seven minutes goes for Reflect, and Phil McCracken goes into a flip turn, pivoting into a, a Pokemon more situated for this position. He goes into Cunnilingus, and he's probably going to go for a Dazzling Gleam. It's going to hit everything on his team. How is Stuart Except... not laughing his ass off? <laughs> <laughs> Cunnilingus. Concentrate. Concentrate. Ah, oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. I just want you to, mm. I want you guys to see all my team, so I have to get them, I have to try and work out how to get all my team in. <laughs> He's very proud of his nicknames this week. I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it. Uh... My man didn't uh... even use a, oh he used a Zapdos as his legendary for this week. So we have new rules uh, every Fuck, 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 fuck. You only to use one legendary, and you can only... Gigantamax, if it is the topic Pokemon of the week. Unfortunately, our canine does not have a Gigantamax <sighs> form. So, Roid Rage switches in on a Dazzling Gleam and gets fucking destroyed. Oh my god. Through the light screen. Oh, nope. He's only got Reflect up. Chomping that is, ass, the Garchomp comes in. Do you think in. this is Scarf Garchomp? Do you, maybe? Maybe perhaps? Do we think it is a Bandit Garchomp? It's not Scarf. Man, he just admitted <laughs> it. Before he, <laughs> <laughs> he could have just I'm, said, I, yeah, I "Oh, it's scarfed as fuck." <laughs> <laughs> it's not scarfed. It's not scarfed. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna scarf uh, up, chomping that ass, bend over. Oh yeah, uh, I'm so scared. I don't know what to do. I'm I'm back in, into. I'm in a corner. I'm in a corner. Who thinks Bend Over is going to 6 0 poor little Morgan Oko? Bend Over's got Morgan in the corner. And he's asking uh -oh. Bend Over. <laughs> oh gosh, Ben. Please don't, Ben. Bend Over goes for a U turn, switches into Ophelia ass, and let me peck it, sits there and takes it like a man. 
I feel your ass. <laughs> I feel your ass. <laughs> you just not getting it? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> shots from Ophelia ass and goes for a roost, trying to get that little bit of extra HP back so that it can go for some attacking moves. Maybe. Possibly. Maybe. If it's lucky. <laughs> <laughs> now we already know what uh, Morgan is going to go for. He's going to switch right into Guard Chomp, aka Chomping That Ass, and he's going to switch in against Phil McCracken, the Mega Swampert. So God weird. damn it. God Mega damn Swampert it. God here. damn it. I don't know what to do. Mega I have Swampert. nothing. I have nothing. He's going to uh, eat an ice punch. He's going to eat an ice punch. He's going to fill his cracking with an ice punch. Oh. Excuse me. Switches into... D Chomping that ass switches into punch me in my butt. Oh, my God. Can't believe he bought Chomp to be. He's going to eat the Rocky Helmet a little bit of chip damage. Oh, what is fuck. punch me in my butt going to do to fill me cracking? Oh. He's gonna talk to that motherfucker. That's what he's gonna do. He's talking. That's right. Well, can't be burned. That's okay. He's on a timer. He's on a timer. Everyone in the agency. He's in, he's on a timer. He's gonna fill McCracken with toxic. <laughs> he's gonna fill McCracken with toxic. Ugh. <laughs> fuck! 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 Guess, fuck! Guess, fuck! Uh, I hate this. I hate your team. I hate your team. I guess Swampert is based off of seven minutes. Britney Spears' Grim Sorrow is going to probably go for a screens. He can't do anything really else to this Phil McCracken right now. He goes for Reflect and gets destroyed by Waterfall and Rain. So now it is 6-4. to four. Blue Corner is in a pretty upper hand position versus the Red Corner. You think? Ugh, fuck, 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 fuck. I got nothing. I got nothing. If you didn't can hear that, Joe I reckon he can live it through a reflect. <laughs> uh, I got nothing to get out of this. I reckon Gatron can live a ice punch through a reflect. Mm, uh, I feel like uh, it will probably die. Risk it for the biscuit. Go for outrage. Uh, I mean, fuck, 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 fuck. I mean, you could stall out with Toxapex if you want to with the banker, Baneful Bunker. And... I don't have Baneful Bunker. Stop Joe talking to me. To Stop talking to me. I didn't bring Baneful bu Bunker. We are live. Uh, fuck, 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 Oh my god. I don't have you, Outrage on it. I brought a different set. Do you you have intimidated F you Jesse? Why didn't you switch that in and then and then double switch, bro? It's called Cuz he's going down. He's going down if I bring in F you Jesse. F you Jesse's going you, down. Bro, you yes, he is. And switch to Toxapex. Do you listen? Listen to me. I'm coaching. <laughs> no, I don't want to be coached. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> he just wants to crack field. <laughs> alright, 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 I'm gonna you listen to it. <laughs> and bend over switches in for Mega Swampert. While oh, FU Jesse switches in for that Intimidate, which was wasted. Okay. What are we gonna do? Oh. He switches into Crocodile. Crocodile must be. Oh, he needs the Wild Charge from FU Jesse. Combat. My cunt! I was gonna. Ah, oh, I had a Pokemon named Mike Cunt. You, you cunt. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, Mike Hunt. God damn, that's 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 a good one. God. Earthquake needs a combat. That's okay. That's okay. Your He's scarf. He's scarf. He's not scarf, guy. Don't lie. Don't don't listen to me. He might not be scarf. Uh He's going for Stealth Rocks right here. I'm calling it right now. It's not RNG if you call it. It's not RNG if you call shit. it. RNG means random number generation or something. <laughs> Ran <laughs> generator. You generator. Jesus. <laughs> random number generations. 
<laughs> Does he? He goes for the earthquake again while he's oh, switching the button. I want to pull Rock Nine up. Is he actually he bluffing? We don't know. Stuart I feel like Mike might six owed. Stuart throws a tantrum like a three-year-old. Does he go for the? He went for the roost with Let Me Peck It while Crocodile switches into Bend Over again. Sounds like you're saying. Uh, that. Uh, <laughs> Fuck. I, I I fucking have nothing for this. <laughs> nothing. What do you uh, mean? You have a Zach in front of a Pelipper. Yes, but it, it, it's not going to do shit to him. It's, it, it, it's not doing anything to him. <laughs> <laughs> and Cunning I've already hit that Pelipper. The bird that I forget the name of. Oh. Bend over. That's what his name is. Let me peck it sits there in frustration as he attempts to not get 6 0 <laughs> yeah, It's tempting. <laughs> I, don't, I don't have much for these guys, to be honest. Our canine switches in on Cunnilingus, eats a, a dazzling gleam, eats and <laughs> sits there deciding what he might do next. What do you guys think he might do? Dang. Our canine is the topic of our show, and he is having a shit first battle <laughs> <laughs> oh and Cunny Linga switches back into Phil McCracken and eats a flare blitz in the rain that does barely anything to Phil McCracken go to Zapdos why stop talking to me stop talking to me why would I go to Zapdos what is he gonna do he's gonna ice punch you in the face and you're gonna die all I'm doing is ine uh, delaying the inevitable. I, there's nothing I can do to, to whittle to whittle his team away. His, he, he, there's there's I'm nothing toxic. I can do. I'm toxic. I'm toxic. It's bad time. You you, you can uh, break the record for Pokey Dippy's uh, most turns in a single battle. Maybe. Okay, that's something to strive for. Let's do that. <laughs> Why are you not using fucking Toxapex? Because I don't fuck? give a fuck. If you take it, I don't give a shit. Shut the fuck up. There's no... Why are you not making it take way longer? Shut the fuck up, stupid ass. That's why. I don't know. <laughs> Am I faster? No, I'm not faster. Damn it. Oh, I lifted. I lifted. No. I, lift ah, I didn't get 6 0 Yeah. <laughs> How did I look there? <laughs> Tom that ass goes down to a waterfall from Phil McCracken. <laughs> <laughs> and Phil McCracken dies of toxic. Morgan, That's all that matters. Morgan I don't know what I want to do. We need a new one. <laughs> Morgan is ignored, but Joe does. What are you talking about? What? <laughs> Morgan doesn't get 6 0'd, but Joe does. Well, yeah, Joe well, hasn't played! Bitch! Every, every <laughs> he's, uh, he's just throwing the shots in. Honey Inga goes for a Volt Switch and destroys the red corner of F.U. Jesse RK9. Switches into Ophelia Ass, and Let Me Peck It comes back out to eat possibly a Psy Shock. Yeah, I don't know. I'm well, it looks like a pretty much passive. Probably. Rising Voltage is going to do half damage with the Life Orb. And Discharge is going to do near nothing. I mean, I, I could boost again. I would even say it does 23% while Let Me Peg it goes down to another Rising Voltage. Oh, and it's over. Toxapex comes in, punch me in my butt. <laughs> <laughs> oh, GG bro. Morgan GG and takes a takes a 5-0 like a champ he didn't get good game game. really all that matters we'll have to check the record good game that is the new record for the pokey dippies of most turns in a battle how many turns was it 35 ugh your team was very good Stu it was very annoying yeah I just threw it together I needed a steel type alright David I'm sending you Let's go. Oh, we didn't get to see my Arcanine. No, we didn't get to see it. Hey, you get the battle next round. So you're, you're that's good. right, that's true. Alright. All right. And it has been accepted. Alright. 
In the blue corner, we got Kamikaze with Arcanine, Driftlim, Rilagoon, Hatterene, Zapdos, and Pelipper versus the red corner with Arcanine, Gastrodon, Amoongus, Tapu Lele, Scizor, and Dragapult. Tapu Lele. Wow. And we start. Who is going to be sent out first? Amoongus named AKA Purple Testes <laughs> switches in versus <laughs> Venus. <laughs> purple Testes? <laughs> Where, how purple. do you know his testes are purple? <laughs> you didn't know? Damn, are his hands his testes? Shit, those are his balls and his head's his dick. <laughs> oh, shit. And this switch is not working. Amoongus is just a dick. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> mind <laughs> one. With the flash fire, flash fire ability. It's a shiny arcane eye. It's gold mm -hmm. as fuck. Baneless. Baneless. The arcane eats that close mm -hmm. combat like a champ. Throws out a nice little toxic. And then. Toxic! We gonna switch out, probably. I'm just saying. He's got a morning stun. <laughs> He's got a morning stun. We're I can see it coming in my hollow. Probably. A, a Baneless. Baneless! Oh! Oh. Get out of here! Arcanine Damn. eats the Scorching Sands, takes the toxic damage, and fucking dies! <laughs> <laughs> brutal. So brutal. <laughs> he switches in Dragapult, aka Mr. Sneak. Bunch of bullshit, if you ask me. And we switch in Pee Pee Burb, the Pelipper, while a Dragon Dance pops off. He didn't uh -oh. sound too confident when he said that. Ah, we good, dog. Hurricane, okay. I'm scold. Mr. Sneak goes for a Dragon Darts, while PP Burb goes for a nice little scald. PP Burb. Exactly. Choke me, Choke me. god damn. <laughs> Choke me, the Hatterene comes out. And it's a in a bad, bad position a, at this moment in time. It's a bad time. It's a bad time. <laughs> uh, what do I do? <laughs> what do I do? <laughs> <laughs> What's going to take a plus one phantom force? We switch into Venus again. We lower that spe that attack damage and we <sighs> keep that phantom force. Both our canines have gone down this match. That was your first mistake. Chunky then, comes back out. I didn't even use, didn't even use mine. Oh. And what is he going to do to me? He goes for a shadow or a phantom force and disappears from the map. It happens. We're gonna eat this phantom force like a champ. We got a sash. Oh. You're going down, the sun. You're going down. That's all I gotta say. I don't think so. Oh, yeah, I might. Mm -mm. He's got Sucker Punch! Whoa, oh, it's sucker, sucker Punch! Sucker Punch! Out of nowhere. You like my Mr. Sneak? Seven fucking minutes says I don't care about Mr. Sneak. Se How'd you get it to let you say fucking? I'm not sure, honestly. <laughs> <laughs> it won't let me do it. He's been on showdown so long, you see. He is, uh, Seven fucking religion. minutes. And testes. I feel like testes shouldn't be good either. <laughs> it's it's not, it's not wrong. Spell <laughs> wrong. And goes down. Can Joe finally pull back a win for the first time in two episodes? Three episodes even. No, dude. Testes, that's science. That's a science word. For sure. 100%. Yeah, no, Six-o-joe. Like Six-o-joe. Six-o-joe. <laughs> You're a dick. You're a fucking asshole. <laughs> Six O Joe the drift limb. Six O oh, Joe. I guess it goes for a call mine. He switches in. Oh no! Here it comes. Here it comes. Does it even matter? I don't know. Honestly, <laughs> he goes for a call mine again. He goes for recover. Sleep. Dippy the gastrodon is just sitting there looking at me. Come on, wake up. You son of a bitch! 
Oh, this is coming down to the wire. And we're still asleep. I don't like this match. What are we going to do? I think we're going to have to lose, I think. For force. And we wake up two turns too late. Oh. Oh, we live in. And he's got he's got it. He's going to do it to me. Fuck you, Joe. Mm -mm. Fuck oh. you. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, fuck you. He strength sapped. He not fucked him. He didn't fuck him. He strength sapped. I said, fuck you, Joe. <laughs> Damn. He goes for the shadow ball after the strength sap. Strength sap. Strength that sap. <laughs> strength sap. Hey, Down goes Dragapult. I think the play was DD. Play with DD, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that nickname. I don't like that nickname. Don't say that out loud. <laughs> I'm not going to. <laughs> this man is fucking crazy. He's still faster than me somehow, but he does destroy me with the shadow ball. Oh, Captain fuck. Goes down to a shadow ball from 6 0 Joe. Sizzle down goes down. Tapu Lele. He can't bullet punch me, so what is he going to do with the Mega Scizor? You can't. What? Oh, I'm alive. What? You're, you're not on the ground. You're not on the ground. <laughs> you're not on the ground. <laughs> he was so confident. He, you can't do that. So what are you going to do? Uh, I, I just showed you, bitch. <laughs> he showed me. He sure fucking showed me. Oh, he switches into Dippy the Gastrodon. While Like You Hate Me comes out. AKA <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna eat that hurricane and take a shit ton of damage and go for a nice little scald. Does he get the burn? No, he doesn't. That would have been nice. Be nice if I hit this hurricane too, buddy. <laughs> and I didn't fucking hit it! Oh, I missed! <laughs> and I take another scald like a champ. We still living. We still fucking living. We roosting oh. up, baby. We roosting. He's yawning again. Uh, oh, the fuck are you? Get the burn. He goes for another scald because he knows I'm switching in. Oh, oh my God! The burn. It's not our <laughs> team. You call it. <laughs> fuck you, Joe. <laughs> you got lucky. That's all. <laughs> and then Purple Tessie switches into seven fucking minutes. Takes a U-turn. With the Rocky Helmet comes back out with the Zapdos. <laughs> like Drill Picket to death. Drill Picket to smithereens. <laughs> I wish. That'd be great. And he goes a oh. couple little oh. bit of <laughs> He's gonna bank on the mess? Oh, I don't know. Let's go! Hurricane hits again and like you hate me takes down the Gastrodon. All he's got oh, left is, is Scizor, oh. Namugus versus Rilligoon and Zapdos. Touch and go here. Touch and go here. We're at turn 30. Purple test. Surely it lived the hurricane. No, oh. no crit. Oh, he got him with the crit. For the crit. Oh. That is sick. That For is the damn. crit. Damn. That's shitty. Scissor hands comes out the the mega scissor and goes for a bullet punch. Wow, thirty three percent. That's dead. It is a dead Rillaboom. Oh my god, it does nothing with Grassy Glide. Seven minutes dies to a bullet punch. Well, I lost. Hey, it was a good game though, except for that crate. He might miss heat. He might miss heat wave. He might miss heat wave. Not one hundred percent. It doesn't matter. Bullet punch might kill me. He didn't go for a bullet punch. Whoa. We roosting. Like You Hate Me is fighting 1v1 versus Mega Scizor. Scissor hands. And we're oh. just going to keep roosting. We're just going to keep fucking roosting. Come on, we see What's going to happen? It's a 1v1. Joe's got never been this close. And he goes down to a heat Oh, wave. no. Well, if you got didn't it. crit me, I could have spored you and it would have been a different game, but... <laughs> 
He's got one. He's got one. He's pissed. He's, he's pissed. mad. The salt comes out from the ground. I'm not he pissed. He did. He's so not pissed. It would have been a what different a fucking game, David. God. Oh, man. That's rough. It's okay. Don't worry. Next week, I'm good. I love you, Joe. Don't hate me. It's okay. Just joke me. Joke me. Joke me. Joke me. <laughs> Are we doing yeah. national deck? No one knew Tapu Lele was out on the field. Come on, guys. What's going on there? We knew. <laughs> we, don't want to we don't want to disenfranchise anyone. <laughs> oh. Alright, so it's uh, Stu versus David. People are going to be so confused until the video comes out. Then they're going to be like, oh. Okay. Dude, I haven't seen the first... Two last two weeks of videos, bro. I know. I still gotta post week uh, the first one and the second one before I post the last two weeks. Why well, wouldn't I make choose my team? Show all teams. Here we are. Oh, I just did a national date. It's not you sent me national date by AG. That's all right. It should oh, I can do it. I can yeah. change it to AG. Yeah. I changed it. I changed it. It's because you're using the Uber, dog. That's all. That's all it is. But I knew you motherfuckers were going to be using Mega Swampert. For some reason, I just knew it. Just knew Man, it. that sucks. That sucks. What sucks? That everybody fucking knew to use Mega Swampert. I didn't use Mega Swampert. I didn't even use a Mega because I'm fucking gangster. What do you mean? You just said you knew about it. You knew that, you knew that we were going to use it. I just knew it because we were fighting against Arcana, and why wouldn't you guys use Mega Swampert? Yeah, I guess that's what I thought too. <laughs> he sends in Mike Oxenfox. <laughs> My cock's on fire. fire. Oh, I said it wrong. Versus like you hate me. So Arcane Mike Oxenfire. God damn, Stu, you definitely win nicknames tonight for sure. He's gonna eat a hurricane. It's gonna confuse him as well off the first turn. He's going for a Z move. He goes for the Gigavolt Havoc, and we live in. Zapdos is out here doing it. He's doing it. I keep forgetting about Z moves. Uh, I'm in a risky position. What do I do? I'm not really sure. I think we're going to go into our canine, a.k.a. Venus, and intimidate that motherfucker. My Venus is too powerful. My box on fire goes for an extreme speed. And that's okay. That's okay. Bendover switches in on a toxic and eats it. Venus is going to have to run from this. Don't get in his head. <laughs> he goes for a U-turn with Bendover while PP Bird switches in. Ooh. Tapu Coco comes back in. Like a boss, hey, hey, what is Tapu Coco going to do? We don't know. Cunnilingus is relative to the Tapu Lele I had. Cunnilingus goes for a volt switch and he is just pivoting all over me. That sounds That's what she said. I love it. He goes for the volt switch, switches into Arcanine. What is Arcanine going to do? Intimidate you. We don't you. know yet. It is going to intimidate me, that is for sure. Is it going to outspeed me, though? We don't know yet. But we're going to find out real fast. Well, we can't outspeed a grassy slide. Hey, you already know. Knockoff is coming. You already know. You already know. Joe doesn't have any idea what's coming. <laughs> me later He's going to woodhammer me to oblivion. That's what's going to happen. He switches into bend over and Ooh. takes the high horsepower like a champ. He knew what was coming the whole time. He was bluffing. He was bluffing so hard. Really, boom would look cooler without the drum. Oh, I love the drum, dog. What do you mean? I don't like the drum. The drum is a staple. 
I don't like it. Oh, we went to the zoo today. Bend over goes for a U-turn into PP Burb and switches back into Tapu Coco, aka Cunnilingus. Or Raichu. No, he's not switching into Raichu right now. It's definitely Cunnilingus. Well, we went to the zoo today and the gorilla slapped the shit out of the window. Damn. <laughs> That's he's, a story he's... Huh? He wanted That's to fight you. Hall. Yeah, it slapped. No, it didn't slap the window in front of me, but. <clears throat> We're on our way Tony to Lingus Wolf switches into Venus. And he just slapped the shit out of the window and ran away. Really? While well, Swamper comes in, aka Phil McCracken. What is Phil McCracken going to do? You know Don't know doing. yet. Don't fucking know. It's very possible, Joe. It's very possible. He switches into Mega Swamper God, and goes for the damn. flip turn. We're eating it though. We're eating it. Seven right fucking now. minutes is out here. He has fucking bolt, bolt turn, U turn, and flip turn. That's how you win, Joe. It's how you win. <laughs> or, you know, get in a crit. That's oh. How, that's also how you win. Are you sure? Specifically, oh, you. That's... that's salt. That's salty. <laughs> you hear that, ladies and gentlemen? That is, that is salt. Damn right. He's mad. He's angry. Doing it for the show. He's got a lot to be <laughs> mad about. It's all right. We all love Joe. Our canine switches back in. My cox on fire takes a grassy glide. It does minimal damage. Seventeen percent to be exact. He's gonna go for the high roll. Venus switches back in on Mike's, my cock's on fire and eats that fla that flare blitz. Gets the agua berry and gets the HP Stupid. back. Damn. Stupid agua berry. Fun fact of the night, I think I'm the only one who ran flash fire arcanine. You are, I think so. Would have been nice on my team, I'm not going to lie to you. Oh. My cock's on fire goes for morning sun and eats the scorching sands like a boss. What is he gonna do next? Oh dear, what am I gonna do? That's uh, just, just too much. Just too much. He's sitting oh, here no. calking. He I'm switches and bend I'm, over. I'm not shut today. And <laughs> Kamikaze goes ag aggressive as fuck. He switches in Zabdos. Trying to call this. Oh, he's in a good position now. Tapu Coco switches in. Cunnilingus is going to eat a hurricane and take more than your record, Morgan. Damage. Do what? I think they're going to break your record for most turns in a battle. No. I was holding on to that. He's going to Volt Switch me again. We already know it. I didn't even bring a ground type. What kind of shit is this? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it, oh, well, everyone with the fucking Mega Swamper did, but I did. Yeah. <laughs> mega Swamper switches back in. Phil McCracken is going to eat up the Venus. <laughs> the Venus. I don't know what to do here. He's going to hit me with the waterfall in the rain. It's going to do quite a bit of damage. Seven fucking minutes, American. the Rilla Goon comes right back out, and what is he going to do with it? What's love no. Got to do? no idea what I'm going to do with it. <laughs> no idea, actually. I'll get fucked up by Grassy Clyde. He switches in my cocks on fire, and he eats another Grassy Glide. It does a minimal amount of damage yet again. <laughs> God damn it. Um, fuck. This is just too stressful for me, you know? Too stressful. <laughs> <laughs> he goes for extreme speed. And he goes down to a grassy glide. My cock's on fire has died. I feel like I was um up shit creek without a paddle there anyway, so it's all good. 
I'll survive. He's singing a song, guys. Fuck, I actually can't beat this. You can do it, I believe. And Cunnilingus switches back in on seven fucking minutes. You know you what are we going to do now? I am not too yeah. sure. We're going to switch in like you hate me. And he's going to eat a thunderbolt. Seven fucking minutes comes right back in this motherfucker. With the grassy terrain. And it's going to do a shit ton of damage to anything that comes back in. Grassy Glide takes out Cunnilingus. There is no more Psychic Surge up for the red corner. I said Psychic, I meant Electric. <laughs> oh dear. Ophelia Ass comes in. Can it eat a Grassy Glide? Is it Sash? I don't know. No, I don't think it's it can. It's not Sash. And it 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 dies to a grassy glide. All right, new rule: David can't use uh, Rillaboom. <laughs> ben Dover comes yeah. in and eats another grassy glide and goes ben down. Dover. Yeah, I think that settles it right there. <laughs> Seven fucking minutes wins the whole entire game. Possibly is this isn't a sash, my cunt. And it's not sash. My cunt, the cro crocodile, goes down to a grassy glide. Well, Phil David. McCracken comes in. Can it eat a banded gr grassy glide? Well, David, I don't what think my do you want to use cunt. Next week? <laughs> <laughs> good enough. game, David. That was a good. That was a good game. We love seeing Willow Boom, 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 Boom kick glass grassy glide ten times. I Did loved you? it. I thought it was very invigorating. It it got my blood boiling. <laughs> yes, oh, sir. Hey, it didn't break your record, Morgan. You, you have the record for 35 turns in a game versus Stewart. Well, thank ah, you, back dude. To losing, back to losing in the final. No. <laughs> <laughs> Stewart and David fight, fight it out in the finals for the third week in a row. All right, what are, what are we using not next week, the week after? Because next week we're having Stephen Redden on. Oh, yeah. Moltres, or wait, we have Moltres next week. Next week, we'll and we use got Moltres with Stephen Redding as a special guest. And then we have Dragonite the week after that. Nice. Okay. Get ready for Extreme Speed Dragonite with Rillaboom, and then a couple of other Pokemon. Exactly. Listen, everybody, <laughs> everybody is mad but me at David because David is the winner tonight. And everybody needs to know. Everybody needs to know that Joe is a salty bitch. It's because you didn't play his bullshit team. That's no. right. <laughs> to be honest, Morgan's the only one who hasn't won one. You know, so yeah, I am. I am. <laughs> but you know what? I'm comfortable worse. down here. I, I'm comfortable down here. I hold the record for most turns in a match. Yeah. You know, so so down here. Down there, sucking dude. Hey. No, never. Not once. Not even once. I think penises are hideous. I think they're fucking disgusting creatures, and I want nothing to do with them. He snorts crack, you mean? Isn't that what you're saying? No, I fucking don't, Stuart. I don't, I don't snort. I don't smoke. I don't do crack. I don't do crack. 2021, Morgan, is the year of crack. I, I, almost, I almost made my Zapdos a, a crack nickname, but right. then I was like, God damn it, I gotta, I gotta let the crack joke cool off. Yeah, he only eats crack. There's... <laughs> yeah, I, I, I actually suppository it. I put it up my ass so that it absorbs <laughs> the, the, the fastest. I just to toss whole ass, whole ass crack rocks in my butthole. He shelves it. He shelves it. Yeah. Yeah. That way, it's clear that the way, because you can't you can't get no infection in your booty hole or nothing like that. Crack you know what I'm saying? So this. I'm just crack 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 crack. I already have the nickname for my Dragonite. Suppository because it's gonna be up our ass all all battle or what? 
Shell yeah. crack. I'm gonna name my whole team Morgan Smokes Crack. <laughs> my dude, I don't fucking smoke crack. I have great skin. <laughs> if you name Fuck Morgan, off. You smoke crack. No, dude. I know. First of all, the only Morgans I know are girls. I don't even know any. Do you know? Do you know? Do you know any other male Morgans? Morgan Freeman. Yeah. Morgan Freeman doesn't count because he's like a, he's like a like a godly type figure. Like he's the narrator. <laughs> he's like the narrator in my house. Like, could, could you even imagine a world without Morgan Freeman? Yeah. No. 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 You couldn't. You couldn't. He's God gonna live forever. Because he's fucking, yeah, he's fucking Morgan Freeman. He's gonna live forever. Hey, it doesn't matter. And so am I. And so am I. So fuck you. Yeah, because he does crack. <laughs> Up his ass. Hey, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, one day, I'm gonna pop a little, a little crack rock into my butthole, and I'm gonna come on here and win one. I'm gonna fuck around and win one once. <laughs> one day. <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm better. I'm getting better every week, and one day I will be just so powerful that none of you will be able to stop me, because I'm just absorbing all this, all this fucking information, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be the greatest one day. Well, since uh, Morgan is hallucinating, I think that's it for the episode. Hi, I want to ask how. Hey, listen, I don't do any drugs on this thing except for alcohol. So, so, so get out of here. All right, carry on. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, next week you will see us with our special guest Stephen Redden, and then the following week uh, we will be doing Dragon Knight. Not doing Dragon Knight, but Dragon Knight will be. Oh yeah, who wants to do Dragon Knight? <laughs> that means it. crack. That means crack. <laughs> right. No, Morgan, stop talking about crack. We know you're obsessed. Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> we will see you guys next time.